Hello and welcome to another Mortal with Phoenix Rising Loot Guide video. In this video we're going to be covering the remaining 7 epic chests in the Forge Lands region of Mortal with Phoenix Rising we didn't cover in the last video. So basically what you have to do is solve puzzles, sometimes kill some enemies and you will get some rewards such as, um, not Ambrosia, Adamantine and gear. The first one can be found over here on the map. As you can see you'll find some boxes here and there's some humans nearby. These humans will be attacked as you can see and you'll have to kill this harpy as you can see once you kill that dude you'll see the chest there and with your heavy lifting ability you can just plonk these boxes onto switches so once you do that you can go and open the chest inside you'll get adamantine and a piece of a line armor set a piece of this set adds 190% damage against unarmed enemies and 200% more stun against unharmed enemies the next one can be found over here on the map as you can see, it's just through that door. Over here, you'll find these two things lit up and two more to the side. And if you just ride them, I think I've already got a similar one tamed, so it's let me ride that. But you'll have to tame them the first time. Doesn't seem like you can get them out there, so I think you have to tame the ones outside. Yeah, I don't have one of these tamed then, so for some reason you can ride the ones in there. So you just tame the horse like usual, slowly walking up to it making sure you don't scare it then you just tame animal and then you should be able to just ride the other one straight away once you tame one you just dump it into here then you grab another as you can see because we've already tamed some we can just straight up mount them once you do that the door will open and you can go to the chest inside you'll get adamantine and a piece of the armor of a boar set a piece of this set adds 42% more damage with combo finishers and 40% more stun with a combo finisher the next one can be found over here on the map as you can see it's just over here once again you'll need heavy lifting you just grab this box here you can then throw it onto there and jump over whatever you want then you need to grab it over again then you want to get over here again you need to get over there so instead of taking it through that path you probably just want to pull it up you can then grab the chest inside you'll get adamantine and a piece of a new olympian armor set a piece of set adds two to health chunks and 40 percent more stun duration the next one can be found over here on the map as you can see it's just here pretty sure you have to go here and request as well so what you want to do is stand on all of them going from well round the rocks will break however if you try to use them to block so instead you want to grab these box so as you can see i can just plonk it here so as you can see after i've stood on that one i can go here then i can put that up then you can go around here and stand on this one sadly that's not the right order you'll have to stand on that one that one that one then this one you can actually see what order it is from the number of torches lit on each so this one has got two the previous one had one and the one we stepped on before has four so as you can see this one's got none but we can just stand on it anyway then we need to plonk it down here for the next one and then it, it opens and you can grab the chest inside you'll get adamantine and a piece of hephaestus armor set a piece of this set adds 26 percent defense and inflicts 670 damage to attacking enemies the next one can be found over here on the map as you can see it's just through there so first you'll see a box here you can place that on here now we need to get a rock and place it on that heavy sword you can find some rocks up here so as you can see i've got a rock now i just need to walk forwards like that making sure i don't let it get destroyed then i want to grab another one and drop down again so you can place three rocks or two rocks in a statue and then you can just stand on it yourself and then you don't have to do it again if you fail you'll have to find more rocks inside you'll get adamantine and a piece of a lion armor set a piece of this armor set adds 325 percent more defense while health is full and adds three to combat meter on hit against unharmed enemies the next one can be found over here on the map as you can see down here there are some enemies to kill so kill them once you do that you can stand here and grab that box you can then grab that and bring it over to the heavy switch over here that will unlock this and that means you can stand here and pull the little box here onto here you can then get a statue of yourself on here or a random rock and you can then go up here and flick the switch 
and that will open the door to you. Inside you'll get adamantine and a piece of the armour of a boar set. A piece of this set refills 11% of the whole chunk on a hit with combo finishers and adds 2 to the combo meter on a hit with combo finishers. The final one can be found over here on the map. As you can see here it is, there are some enemies here so make sure you kill them. When you've done that you'll see many push plates here, sit, so you'll see two boxes here you can grab. There's also this underwater area. And if you swim over here, you can swim under here and up into this room. Inside here, you'll find some pomegranates and a box. You can just flick that to get out. Since there aren't any more, you just have to arrange for them in the pattern like this. You can then grab a chest over here. Inside, you'll get adamantine and a piece of a Hephaestus armor set. A piece of this set adds 26% more defense and then inflicts 670 damage to attacking enemies. So that's all for this Immortals Phoenix Rising loot guide video. Hope you found it useful. If you did, please like and subscribe so I don't miss another. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.